We are talking about how to help you improve your credit on the Guy Dawson Show today, and I have the champions of credit, Cynthia Davis <laughs> right. and Elisa Flowers in the studio, and my co-hostess with the most is Corintha Turvalon. And hey. <laughs> We were just talking a few minutes ago about the financial impact of having a credit score that is higher than lower, and I guess there are going to be some people out there either watching the show live or, or the archive of it that are saying, you know, how long is this going to take? And is this something that it's going to take me five years to do to be able to improve my credit scores how long how long does it take well the average is about six to nine months certainly for me I had a bankruptcy and it was deleted in 30 days so it can happen much faster but there's people in their 400s 500s I mean Elisa and I both have helped hundreds of people and you know the average is about six months nine months r truly a year at most but the beauty of it is that we're gonna also educate them on what to do to build positive credit pay down their debt we take a multi-angle approach to it so if they do the things that we suggest it can be much quicker they really do dictate that time. Let's talk about that positive credit. What are some mm -hmm. of the steps that you, you start working with people on to, you know, once you've stabilized everything and you're wanting to start to grow the credit, what types of, of things do you offer? Sure, absolutely. Well, you know, the, the important part is knowing how your credit score is configured. So let's just talk about some of those components. Um, like 35% of your credit score is how you pay your bills. So you have to pay your bills on time. Out of 100%, 35% is how you pay your bills. The other chunk is 30% of the amount of credit that you use. So when it comes to credit lines and credit limits, you never want to max out your credit limit or your credit line. You want to keep it somewhere around 30%. Once you start going 50, 60, 70, the creditors are, that's a red flag to them. And you will see your credit score decrease a little bit. And that's why our credit scores fluctuate on a daily basis, how we're using our credit limits. And then you have 15%, um, which is your length of your credit history. So how long have you had credit? You have uh, people out there that are applying for credit and they're getting denied just because they don't have any credit. So their length of credit history, there's nothing there for them to judge. So they can get denied for that. Um, and then you have um, a 10% what type of credit. So a good mix of credit would be uh, a car loan, a mortgage, uh, a credit card, a gas card, a revolving credit account. So you have to have that type of mix of credit to maximize the credit score. So, you know, if you, maybe you're someone that does not have any negative items and you're wondering, how do I get to the 750s and above? Having that good mix of credit is what's going to get you up there. Oh. Yes. It seems like a big part of what your program uh, would be about is just the accountability that a person has to have to be able to improve their lives. It's, it's amazing that we have to have so much accountability. And I'm including myself because I've already told all of you that I am, I mean, I have to be as real as anybody else, right? right. Is that, but it's, we have to have people to hold our hands yes. to do things that you would think that we would be able to just take care of on our, on our own. Well, and that's the thing is that, I mean, time is money, right? It seems like all of us just don't have time for this kind of stuff. That's why it's, you know, we're so busy with our families and with our work and all the things that we want to do. And all we want to do is relax for a second. We feel like that's what we have to spend time is doing something like this, right? So we try to make it very easy and have it all in one place. You know, this type of education that Lisa's talking about is in their website. They can see it right away at a time when it's convenient for them. But at the end of the day, I think what's most important about what she's saying is, 35% of your credit score, the biggest hit mm -hmm. is your payment history. So mm. if you don't have any credit cards, that's a problem. You can say you hate credit cards and you can hate them all day long if you want to, but the payments that are hitting your credit score, it's nothing else can give it to you like that. Mm -hmm. um, when you're paying your rent, you know, you're paying rent, that's the one thing that you pay all this money to and you're not getting any credit for that on your credit report. We have a program called Rental Karma where they can do that and they can go back up to two years and get two years worth of positive rental history. I've seen some people get 7,500 
hundred, hundred twenty five yes. points simply from putting that in their credit report. Wow. So you help them take some negative off, put some positive things like a secured credit card mm -hmm. maybe because you probably don't qualify for a credit card today at 500 credit score, yeah. you know? So we can help them get a card until they earn that responsibility back and then they can go out and get traditional credit cards and get a mortgage and all the things that they want at a much better rate. But you got to prove it first with these other things. Mm -hmm. yes. And financial uh, education services is an A-rated Better Business Bureau company. And Absolutely. I, I've known about FES for, for several years, and one of the reasons why I'm such staunch supporters of these ladies and other people in that uh, particular company is just the reputation that they've developed. Absolutely. because. Yes. There have been some less than reputable credit repair businesses, and uh, a lot of people are aware of them. and And I want to promote these ladies because we can't just have these absolutes, like what Cynthia was saying a second ago. You can't just say, "Well, I'll never have a credit card again." And it's like when you have that type of thinking, you don't allow yourself to receive a possible life raft, yeah, exactly. which could be financial education services helping you just because there's bad credit reporting um, or credit repair companies in the world doesn't mean that every one of them is bad. And so the, the fact that they are A-rated with the Better Business Bureau speaks yes. a lot. Yeah, yeah, I've been around since 2004, you know, and to have a high rating like that in this industry is unheard of, and we've had it since 2004. So, I mean, you know the first place they would go if they didn't like what you do. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Go straight to the Better Business Bureau, and, and then you'd all hear about it. So, yeah, yeah, we're Absolutely. very proud of that. I do have a quick question for yes. you ladies. So, in terms of financial education services, so... When I hear that, I immediately think, uh, how do, how am I receiving this education? Um, you know, is it through a website with videos? Do I come and meet with you, get one-on-one -on -one counseling? How does this all happen? And that's that. Sure, absolutely. So, you know, each client has access to the information via an online portal that they get. Oh, yes. Okay. And, you know, we have a customer support department. If you have mm -hmm. any questions about anything, mm -hmm. you are you have access to them mm -hmm. at no problem. Um, and then as agents like myself, my goal is to help our clients get that education because what I want them to do is I want them to go to the program. I want them to develop new habits when it comes to credit. Mm -hmm. So, you know. Back to what Goss, uh, Guy said, you know, oh, I'm not going to use credit. You have to know your relationship with credit. Mm -hmm. When people say, oh, no, I'm not going to use credit, they have bad habits. They, <laughs> they don't know how to use credit to mm -hmm. their advantage. Mm -hmm. okay. So, you know, it, it's education. You're not just getting your credit restored. So we are educating you so you can maintain good credit, build positive credit. Yes. Excellent. Yeah, and these are exciting times because you have uh, champions like these ladies <laughs> out here who yeah. who can give you hope, and yeah. it might make the difference between you getting a job or not. Yes. Because now a lot of these employment applications include them pulling your credit. I guess they figure that if you have poor poor credit scores, you're more likely to not be as good of an employee. So when you look at it like that, mm -hmm. that could be the difference between you getting a $50,000 a year job. Yes. It's just the fact that you have poor credit. I've seen so many people in that case, I can't even tell you. I have like three examples on the top of my head that I'm thinking of, of people that, you know, had all the background. They had the college education. They had all the marks that they're supposed to have on their on their resume. But because they didn't have the credit score that one of the other candidates had, they didn't get the job. Wow. And I've seen it from the managerial side of it. Oh. And I've also seen it from the other side of it. As a credit person helping somebody that just kept not getting the job, they did our services. And 60 days later, they got the job. Nice. It's, it's literally 60%. And the number is going up of employers that are doing this. Wow. And we were just in Kansas City and I was talking to a girl. She's like, I was wondering why I couldn't get a job. I didn't mm -hmm. even know they did that. Again, now she's got great credit, went and applied, and she has making eighteen dollars an hour. And for her, that was a lot. She's in her twenties, you know. Yeah. So it's like it is. It's a life changing thing to have good credit score. It really is. We're yeah. near the end of the segment, ladies, but I want you to give information about how people can get in contact with you to raise their credit scores. Absolutely, we can be reached at area code seven zero two five two seven four one zero one. Again, seven zero two five two seven four one zero one. And tonight we're having a credit workshop, 2850 Horizon Ridge Parkway Suite 200 at 730 sharp.
Yep. Let the credit champions train you. <laughs> Get in the right. ring with your credit. <laughs> yes. Throw a right hook and knock it out and put a jab to that Save somewhere. a whole lot of money and get a good job. <laughs> yes. And thanks again so much. We look You're forward welcome. to having you back very soon. Thank, Thank you, you so for much, having guys. us. We are going to go to commercial break and our resident health advocate, D. Ennis, with Life Shots, mm -hmm. is going to be in the studio to try to help you with your physical health. We've been working uh -huh. on your credit health. Now we're going to work on your physical health. Stay tuned. Nice.